I want to talk to you a little about Project Vigilant, which is an initiative started by Thames Valley Police back in May of 2019. Following the tragic murder of Sarah Everard, all of our thoughts have turned to the risks facing women and girls on our streets. But of course those risks exist for us all, and it's important that as well as driving change in attitudes, particularly towards women, that we also ensure strong policing to drive down crime on our streets and keep us all safe. Project Vigilant has started in Oxford. It involves covert and overt tactics to focus on potential perpetrators and avoid victim blaming, making sure that the police spot those conducting suspicious behaviour and intervene early with a uniformed response. This has seen more than 50 men stopped and questioned. It's seen a number of arrests and successful charges for sexual assaults. More importantly, it's driven down offending in the city centre. We've seen a 50% reduction in reported rapes and a 30% reduction in less serious sexual assaults. This is making a real difference. And when the nighttime economy reopens following the lifting of the COVID restrictions, we're looking to roll that programme out across the rest of Thames Valley's major nighttime economy centres. We all have a role to play in shifting attitudes towards violence and the police must be proactive in preventing offences from taking place and ensuring confidence from victims in reporting their crimes to the police. Anyone who has been a victim can contact the police on 101 at any time or contact the Police and Crime Commissioner's Victim Service victims-first.org.uk or call 0300 1234 148. Preventing sexual assaults in the nighttime economy, tackling knife crime and ensuring more visible policing through supporting neighbourhood teams is all part of my plan to reduce crime across the Thames Valley. Find out more on my website, matthewbarber.co.uk.